learners, I hope you are well. I'm teacher Sharon from Greenview Schools Kamumu. I'll be taking you through mathematics activities, grade three. Welcome. Okay, well learners, today we are going to, to look at adding. Adding by breaking apart. And before we go to that, we know that addition means putting together. Mm -hmm. Putting together also means by addition. And today we are going to look at addition by breaking apart. And when I say addition by breaking apart, I simply mean that we are going to break a number into hundreds, tens, and ones. Let us remind ourselves of how we did this last time. So we have a number like 520. Three. Learners, which number is this? 523. So we are going to break this number into hundreds, tens, and ones. And as I always say, when we are breaking numbers into hundreds, tens, and ones, we start from our left side. Where here we have ones, here we have tens, and here we have hundreds. So that means we start with our number here, five. The place value of 5 here is hundreds. So we are going to write, to break this number, we write 500. Then we are our 2 in the place value of tens. So this is going to be 20, meaning 2 tens. And then lastly we have 3 in the position of 1s. Then we are going to write 3. So we broke down our number into, we have 500. 20 and then 3. That's why we say the number 523. So in front of me here, I have cards with sums written on it. So I'm going to pick a card and then we're going to look at the number that we are going to add by breaking apart. Sorry. So I pick my first card. So which numbers are shown on my card? We have 381 plus 18. So I'm just going to pin it here so we can all see. Our number there is 381 plus 18. So let's add these by breaking apart plus 18. So like I said first, we're going to break these numbers before we start our addition. So let's break 381. So we start with the 3. This will be 300. Then we go to 8, which is the place of 10. So this is going to be 80. Then lastly we have 1. Then we are going to break 18. So we are, since we don't have 100, we are going to pick 1, which is the place of 10, which is 1 10. And then we have 8. So, let's add our numbers. So, what is 1 plus 8? Learners, what is 1 plus 8? Yeah, 1 plus 8 is 9. So, we write 9. Then here we have 80 plus 10. What is 80 plus 10? 80 plus 10 is 90. Very good. Then lastly, we have 300. And since we don't have any other number below 300, we are going to drop that 300 here. And lastly, we are going to have our answer. So we have 390 and 9. So our answer here is 399. So we come here and we put our answer. So let's look at another example, learners. Example number two. I hope you are enjoying doing this with me. So I pick another card and we have another sum here 615 plus 23. So let me peel the card here so we can all see. Mm -hmm. So the number is 615 plus 23. And like I said, the first thing we do is to break the numbers. So here we have 6, which is the place of 100. So this is 600. Then we have 1 in the place of 10. That is 110. Then we have 5 in the place of 1. Then the second number, we don't have hundreds. 
So you have two, the place of tens, and you have three, the place of ones. So we add learners, what is five plus three? What is five plus three? Good, five plus three is eight. Then you come next to what is 10 plus 20. 10 plus 20 will give us 30. And like I said, since we don't have a number below 600, we drop 600. So what is our final number? We pick 600 and 38. So this is going to be our answer. Well done, learners. I hope everyone has understood it. So I'm going to give you some few sums here that you're going to do on your own for more practice. I hope you'll enjoy doing this with me. So I'm going to pick another card so that we see which sums we're going to work on. And this is my first card for extended activity number one. I pick another one for extended activity number two. And lastly, the last one for extended activity number five. So I hope you're going to enjoy doing this activity at home. Well, my learners, that's all the time that we had. Um, your teacher, teacher Sharon, hope you're going to see each other again in the next lesson. Be safe and take care.